जो खाक में मिले उसे मिलता है आशना जो खाक में मिले उसे मिलता है आशना ए आजमाने वाले ये नुस्खा भी आजमा ए आजमाने वाले ये नुस्खा भी आजमा उनके लिए तो बस है खुदा का यही निशा उनके लिए तो बस है खुदा का यही निशा यानी वो फजल उसके जो मुझ पर है हर जमा यानी वो फजल उसके जो मुझ पर है हर जमा देखो खुदा ने एक जहां को झुका दिया देखो खुदा ने एक जहां को झुका दिया गुम नाम पाके शोहरा आलम बना दिया गुम नाम पाके शोहरा आलम बना दिया जो कुछ मेरी and i'm very grateful to and the muslim for what you do for muslim community thank you, you, know, thank you, you. promote islam al- more than any other other community you know thank i've you. always said it and whenever i've attended any events of yours you know thank you. and um, i'm hayat sahab you know he knows me very well and he will allow me to speak it doesn't matter whether i'm invited or not he will say let intiha diya main ik gareeb tha mujhe कुछ ऐसा फजल हजरत रबुल बरा हुआ organizing the shutter speed is things oh. and then once he's organized his plans and then he gets everybody to do things so we come all over the place from all over the place and start doing things with him so you know next time check with us first <laughs> don't force us down us our throats all the time but anyway it's a great event good idea and uh, i can see the people here have been really enjoying i highlight the fact that the people he's roped in to help uh belong to his community the md muslim community so we end up sponsoring all his uh, an uh, uh, anecdote sort of uh, ad hoc programs that he thinks of and conceives of but he's a great guy he does a lot of community community work with us so that's the first thing secondly um i just want to tell all the residents we brought some uh, through invitation uh, uh some of your uh, civic Uh, responsible representatives local councillors and uh, you should be grabbing them here bobby dean who is the uh, parliamentary hopeful is taken over from tom break who lost his seat last time so he's going around uh, preparing himself for the next general election we know boris is going to wiggle out and he's going to have an election soon so he's preparing for that your mp elliot coburn is supposed to be here but i haven't seen him yet So when he does I hope you can grab him too. Um we have some councillor Jane McCoy sitting over there. She's uh, from next door. There's Jane and Sadiq next to the both councillors from South Wallington next door, next ward here. And we had Ed here earlier who's uh, your councillor here. 
and he, but he had to go somewhere to another event. So he, there was a message to Her Majesty the Queen Victoria and Her Majesty the Queen Elizabeth. Uh, so like thanks up. Uh, would you like to? Tahir likes her. Tahir likes her. Tahir had it. So what? Oh yes, of course I know. I I'm used to Tahir likes her. Assalamualaikum. May the peace and blessings of Allah be upon you all. Thank you once again for, for coming out today. Although the weather's not the best, but it's, you made it a great day by coming out and, and sharing your celebrations with us here today. I just wanted to say a few words. Um, I, don't, I know uh, Nasus has spoken quite a bit, so I just want to keep it very brief. Um, but um, like he mentioned, the founder of our community, he wrote to Queen Victoria. Uh, on and this was in 1897. It was in 1897 during her Diamond Jubilee, uh, and he wrote to her. He wrote the book. Uh, uh, Nasser holding it out, a gift, a gift for the Queen, and he wrote just briefly. And that, at that time, you have to understand, it was the British rule in India in, 18, in the 1800s, 1900s. So in 1897, when he wrote this book for her, he said, "Thanks to God, He showed us, who showed us this day of great joy." that we witnessed the 60th jubilee of our honored queen, the Empress of India and England. Who can imagine the amount of, jay of, the amount of joy this day has brought? Congratulations filled with joy and gratefulness from us to our benevolent and benignant Empress. May God keep her joyful forever. We pray to God who has created this earth and raised the heavens and has put the radiant sun and the moon in our service that may he keep our honoured ruler, the Empress of India, safe for a long time. And our present Caliph, the worldwide head of the Ahmadiyya Muslim community, the community that we all belong to, His Holiness Hazrat Mirza Masroor Ahmad, has also expressed his gratitude for the benevolent reign of Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth. And His Holiness prayed, O powerful and noble God, through your grace and blessings, Keep our honoured Queen forever joyful, in the same way that we are living joyfully under her benevolent and benign rule. Almighty God, be kind and loving to her, in the same way that we are living in peace and prosperity under her generous and kind rule. Further, it is my prayer that may God the Exalted guide our honoured Queen in a manner that pleases Him. May God the Almighty also guide the progeny of Her Majesty to become established on the truth and to guiding others towards it. May the attributes of justice and freedom continue to remain the guiding principles of the British monarchy. I once again congratulate Her Majesty from my heart on this occasion of great joy. I present my heartfelt and sincere congratulations to our noble Queen. Once again, thank you very much for joining in. If you do want to, uh, we do have copies of this book. If anyone is interested, they're free, uh, so you can come and pick them out. Uh, but once again, thank you very much for, for, for coming and celebrating this day with us once again. Thank you very much.
اب عزیزم عصمت اللہ صاحب جو ایک عرصے سے غائب تھے جاپان سے نمودار ہوئے ہیں وہ حضرت مسیح مدد علیہ السلام کا منظوم کلام پیش کریں گے ہم نے کوئی دین محمد سانا پایا ہم نے کوئی دین محمد سنا پایا ہم نے کوئی مذہب نہیں ایسا کہ نشا دکھلا کوئی مذہب نہیں ایسا کہ نشا دکھلائے یہ سمر باغ محمد سے ہی کھایا ہم یہ سمر باغ محمد سے ہی کھایا ہم نے ہر طرف فکر کو دوڑا کے تھکایا ہم